and she speaks on the mark of the beast. Someone asked her about it. Now I remember I seen a video like it was on the news with a bunch of white people saying we will not take the mark of the beast. Some people says it's a microchip that they go and put into your hand or in your forehead and you have to use that to buy stuff you know or to receive payment. What if the mark of the beast is right now? Um, let me tell you I do believe the mark of the beast is already here um, and they've been in preparation for it for the longest like the government, the industry, um, many types of people who are just lost or working for Satan himself but it's just the mark of the beast will not be fully forced and plastered um, and put on the list of mandatories and prerequisites for daily life things until the tribulation period. Revelation 13 and 18 says, this calls for wisdom. Let the man who understand calculate the number of the beast. And basically the number of the beast is 666 it says this in revelation it also alludes to the mark of the beast being other things so we don't know what other numbers or names it's going to be for say but the bible just states that it will be 666 and it says it will be put in the forehead or on the right hand um or in the forehead and in the right hand i can't remember and I'm not sure if it will be physically seen or not. That part is kind of conflicting with people in different versions of scriptures that you read. But I think in King James it says it will be in. So you may not be able to physically see it. But you will know whether you have it or not. And you will be able to know if other people have it or not. It is spiritual too. So it is spiritually damning a person. You were spiritually damned when you received the mark. So yeah. But don't let this scare you because you will always have a choice for anything, whether you want to choose right or wrong, evil or good. God gives us a choice, so the enemy must give us a choice. So if you were to be in the tribulation, I'm not trying to be in the tribulation, I'm trying to be raptured. See y'all later. But um, if you were to be a part of that and you were to be asked if you wanted to receive the mark or not, do not. Be strong. They will try to commence torment. Be strong for Christ because... Heaven is waiting on the other side um, and Jesus is waiting on the other side because you were strong willed and you chose him who is the true winner. So, yeah, it's really nothing to be afraid about. It really isn't. It just sounds scary because it's different and it's new, but it's going to happen. This stuff is real. You see where the world is now and what we're getting to, but it's imperative that we speak on it.